final day for the Sydney Shield between the Samari Saints and the Hills Bulls. An awkward one to take from the kickoff. It's gone backwards here from Hills. And then a real mix up. There's new Tilly Schmidt in there along with Marie. Poo Poo now once more. Floating it across field here. Danger again here from Sublaban. Sublaban, more than danger. It's disaster. The first set here for the Samari Saints. Is Marshall decides to go directly at the line this time around. Midway through the count. Still a man down the line. Utili Schmidt sees a little opportunity here for Marie, who goes straight where that defender was meant to be placed and gets it to ground. Does he? They'll have a little check. He's been held up. But away from the first defender, not the second, though. He's caught 12 away. Utili Schmidt with Caesar James on his hip. Goes that way. Good delay on the pass. Smith getting very close. Damon Smith spins, gets the ball to ground. And the Hills Bulls are on the board here in the grand final at Netstrata Jubilee Stadium. And 10 metres in from the grandstand side of the field. Just around 20 back. And slams into the upright, so no change to the score. Yeah, working it nicely now towards the centre of the post before Nutili Schmidt has a little crack himself. Nutili Schmidt, he's just so creative out of acting half. Once again, picking up the ball in two hands. Saw Caesar James on his outside. The little dummy was all he needed. And he went through a gap that opened up like Sydney heads. Three from about 20 metres back this time. No clashing with the uprights. Straight over the black dot. Ten points to six. Brad Avery's on the board. And full board down low. Marshall has a good opportunity to have a run at them here. Marshall had opened up big time. They just sat on their heels. It's the last possible thing you could ever do against Dylan Marshall. He spotted it straight away. And then it was just electric. Bouncing off the feet like a kangaroo out there. So a full set once more to see if Watson has a crack himself. Two metres away now from the line. New Tilly Schmidt, watch for the barge over. He goes out the back for Caesar James off the left, off the right. Muhammad Ali style, floating like a butterfly, stinging like a bee. And the Hills Bulls get their fourth try, the grand final. At all to speak of here at Cogra. Avery, it's not a particularly pretty looking kick, but it's effective nonetheless. 22 points to six. Now some hard yardage set here from the halves. They look to shift it. Straight away an opportunity now for the Saints and they put on the afterburners too. He's away here to Aval. To Aval with Dutt as an option back through the middle. Out of the tackle of Avery. Tries to get the arm around the outside. He won't need it. Oh, to Aval has gone all the way. And that is better than Vows you'll get on a wedding day. It's to Aval, baby. Penciling golden point. We'll see what happens. Short kickoff. Avery attempts it. Has another little crack at them. Gets a second toe to it. And I think that has actually come off. Yes, it has. So there was a play at it, a little bobble in the process, a step off that left foot and go bang instead. Sent it a little wider still, not a bad play at all. Watson now has a crack and Watson burrows underneath them like a little rabbit and he comes up with the carrot. Try time here for the Hills Bulls. What a start to the second half. 15 metres back and 15 metres in from that sideline and he makes no mistake. So held the ball in two hands, had options on his outside. Sub Laban now has a member tracking around the background. That's Stokes and Stokes links up with Brown. Brown gets a nice ball away to a vow again. Crash, bang, wallop to a vow. Oh, he's way too big, way too good, way too strong. That is from the top shelf from to a vow. Easing through a couple of defenders. He works it to within 10 meters of the try line. Sub Laban again, lovely flat pass. This time for Gordon. Gordon's all the way through them. Jed Gordon gets another try here for the Samari Saints and it is game on at Netstrata Jubilee Stadium. Nice kick in boot and sends it on its way, holds its line. So margin back down to six, 28 points to 22. To Aval, now back to Sublaban. Sublaban out the back here for Stokes, building nicely. Here they go once more, putting on the foot here is Iaria. And Iaria getting very close, but dragged across the sideline. Good scramble from the Bulls. They have a real good shot here to try and extend that margin. Watson has another crack at them. Watson stretches out, gets the ball to ground. And they're heading back in the in goal. That should be confirmed here from the referee. It is Thomas Watson picks up his second out of acting half. 15 metres away on the last now here for the Hills Bulls. Marshall at first receiver to the right. 
That's the way they go. Lovely floating cutout pass, a little too far out in front of Apawalo. An absolute brain explosion here as well from Hall. Here and now James. two of our is off for the charge. Here comes Jaber. Jaber fended away. Two of our gets a hat trick. What a play from the centre. He's got spiders on him today. Well, that was mental. Mental from Hall. What was he thinking? Stokes. Send it on its way. It's a nice strike. Curling and just twisting a little too far. Waved away. That could be a big miss. Boos. He's caught. 15 metres away. They'll send it here for Sublaban. The kick. Bang on that try line. They're coming through for it. They've got above them. St Mary's have the ball and have a try. Here comes a grandstand finish. An easy kick here for Stokes. And somehow he's missed it. It's Luke Cavell from the early 2000s. It's from in front. It's hit the uprights away. It goes. Well, that could also be crucial. What has happened there for Stokes? Must keep it alive. Here's Brown. Brown takes off. It bounces here for Dutt. Still alive for the Saints. Now for two of our. Chips it over the top. They claim it here. The Hills balls. And with 40 seconds to go, that should be enough. Foreman will wind down the clock. Three, two, one.